So let's see how we can create collisions and a few meshes from our fractals in uh, Unreal Engine 5. So to do this, you will need a Houdini Engine plugin. And you can find it here on the Side Effects website. It's totally free, so you can just create an account and install that. And once you did that, you should be able to see the Houdini Engine button here. So here I'm using um, Bulb Light level, so just double click on that and you will see the same fractal. And I want to create the mesh out of this one. So just be sure that Houdini Engine has a session running, if not create session here. And then you can go in Houdini folder, select Bulb Light, which is the same formula we see here, and just drag that into the viewport and let it finish and now we have to set the position of the Houdini file to the same as the bulb light blueprint so just put it under it and reset the positions like this you can now remove that so as you can see the rotation are the same in the blueprint and in Houdini, like that. Then we have to tell Houdini where the bounds of the fractal are. And to do that, you can just create a new box or a new cube and center that to the center, of course, to the center, and change the scale to something like, let's try two. Okay, you see that not all the fractal is inside the cube, so let's try 2.5. Okay, this should work really well. And now we can tell Houdini to use this cube as bound for the mesh. And to do that, just go under Start Selection, click the cube, and use Current Selection. Now Houdini is calculating the mesh. We can now uh, disable the view of the cube. And as you can see, we have the mesh on top of the um, blueprint. So if you disable the blueprint, this is the raw mesh of the fractal. So there's a few settings we can change for the for in, to increase the quality or the detail level of the fractal mesh. So under Mandelbaum Light here, you have subdivisions and detail level. So subdivisions is basically how many polygons there will be. And detail level is like the how fat the fractal will be. So let's try to set the detail level to 300. As you can see, this is really fat fractal. So the maximum is like 1000. And as you can see, much there's too much detail. So it's not really looking good, but you have to increase the subdivision to something like 600. Okay, this is looking way better. And of course, uh, it's always a question of compromise between the subdivision and the detail level. In this case, we have too much detail and the subdivision is not able to like to pick all the details because you don't have enough polygons so we can just decrease the detail level to something like 950 and as you can see this is way better so you just have to play with these values and you can go crazy with the subdivision like 1000 even more and this is going to take a while, like a few minutes. But that's basically it.